Peggy Esperanza drove for the Newton Community School District for years. She's shocked and devastated, saying CBD oil for her arthritis triggered a positive drug test. That was presented to me as being THC free. Esperanza says she started using CBD oil a couple months ago. All of the arthritis in my hands, my knees, and my back improved. She says that helped her on the job driving children with special needs to and from school. But Esperanza says she was drug tested after a minor accident in a school vehicle. She failed the drug test. I said this can't be. No way. I, I don't do any drugs whatsoever. It was a positive for marijuana. THC. Mm -hmm. A trace. A trace of THC. Yeah, Esperanza says the district has tested her several times. This was the first one she failed. Any person who hears that with any of their family members is going to feel awful, especially knowing this was all caused by a legal product. In Iowa, it's legal for CBD oil to contain a small amount of THC. I spoke with two CBD shop owners who say that can show up on drug tests. I'm 76 years old. I can retire. But there are individuals who are supporting families that this would even be more devastating to them. Be terminated effective immediately. This letter from the district brings a lot of emotion to Esperanza. She is getting ready to move because she can no longer afford her apartment. What will you miss the most about? My kids. My kids. They are special need kids who go through changes not well. I've had most of them on my bus for the six years I've been driving and a bond has been made. So I will miss my kids. The Newton School District declined to comment on this story. In Newton, Scott Carpenter, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.